Hey everybody, what's up? It's the Wizard here, and today I'm going to be reviewing the Nuvu Bijou deck and the Nuvu Perle deck. Taking a look at the front of the tuck cases, as you can see, the Nuvu Bijou deck is done in a very beautiful green and gold design mixed with a little bit of white, while the Nuvu Perle deck has a stunning blue and white look to it. Now, of the two tuck cases, my preference definitely goes to the Nuvu Perle tuck. Now, on the side, we have Perle and Bijou on each respective deck with some very nice scroll on each side. And the other side of the tuck has the exact same thing. And the bottoms are very simple with the logos in the center and some designer info on each side. And if you take a look at the tops, they are identical except for being in different colors. And the sticker seals both say 2017 on them and are absolutely stunning. Then here is a glimpse of the back designs. Now opening up each respective tuck, as you can see the detailing continues onto the tuck flaps and looks absolutely stunning. But beyond the designing on the flaps, the designs do not continue to the insides of the tuck cases. Now taking a look at the cards that you get with these decks, absolutely no space has been wasted for ad cards. Now looking at the jokers themselves, the jokers are identical in design, except for the fact that each is colored differently. And the jokers of the Nouveau Bijou deck are over a more parchment colored back in that both the back design and the face are on this like vanilla colored stock paper which is a very nice touch and then the jokers and all the cards in the Nuvu Perle deck are on a navy blue type stock. Now looking at the back designs as you can see the back designs are also pretty much identical except for colorations and this set definitely will come in handy in Magic in that you can switch cards, although I do believe that when you do card switches they will stick out like sore thumbs, so that's just something to keep in mind. Now looking at the faces of the decks, the faces on these decks are absolutely exquisite. If you look at the aces, there is a peacock design and they are absolutely stunning. In addition, every card is fully custom, and all the pips and all the faces are absolutely amazing. So just going through, as you can see, no detail has been ignored, and even the court cards are amazing. And taking a look at the Perlay deck, as you can see, the exact same situation. However, as I'm going through these cards, the one thing that I'm noticing about both decks is that both decks seem to actually pick up the oils and the greases from my hands a lot quicker and a lot easier than what your average deck of cards would. As a result, these cards will likely clump earlier and have a shorter lifespan than your average deck of cards. Now taking a look at how this deck handles, both decks, the Nouveau Bijou deck and the Nouveau Perle deck, are of the rough same thickness as a bicycle standard deck of playing cards. In addition, both decks are also slightly more flexible, they have a modern cut, and the borders are thin, thus making them excellent for fans and spreads, even if you have small hands. Furthermore, both decks have an embossed finish, which means that they will flourish very smoothly and very easily in the hands. However, as I said before, both of these decks pick up oils and greases much easier than your average deck, even if it's just from newly washed hands. As a result, these decks will clump sooner, and they will not last as long as an average deck. 
So that's it for this video. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to see more content like this. And as always, go out in the world and be brilliant.